Bright and Charlotte here. A lot of you guys have been requesting a DIY school supply, so I'm going to show you three Tumblr notebooks for school. So first, for the cupcake notebook, you will need pom-poms, patty pans, and of course, a book. Start off by cutting your patty pans in half. I use these silver, like tin ones, and they're from Coles, and they're really inexpensive and cheap, and you can use any kind of patty pans you would like to match your pom-poms and your notebook. Then take your scissors and cut off the bottom of the patty pan so you just have one long side of the patty pan. I was originally just going to do one big cupcake but I thought that'd look a bit weird so I decided to do a couple of small cupcakes. So just cut your patty pans in half to whatever size you would like them to be. I just cut them straight down the middle so they were kind of smaller cupcakes and then lay them out and tip number one lay them out, have them perfect, and then decide you're going to glue it. I laid five out, then glued one down, then realized they weren't going to all fit. And by the time I'd glued two of them down, I realized, oh, I left like a huge big gap in the middle. So just don't do what I did and just lay them out before you do them. Then begin to lay down your pom-poms. I did three at the bottom, two at the middle, and one at the top. And I did each patty pan slash cupcake with a different colored top. So this one I did pink. And then I started gluing them down. And I started by gluing them individually. But I found out when I went through and did like the other ones that to glue the book and do a big line at the bottom and stick them down and then glue another line and then stick them down and then glue another line. And that is your completed cupcake notebook. Now we are going to move on to the splatter notebook. So what we need is just a white notebook. I could not find a white notebook for the life of me. So I just contacted white contact over a composition notebook, which you can still kind of see, but it doesn't matter. So start taking your nail polish. I just chose three neon colors, a neon yellow, a neon green, and a neon pink. And I started splatting it all over it. And I got this idea by watching a nail hot video on Instagram. I just saw like, someone splattering their nail polish. I'm like, oh my god, I could do that on a book. So I started doing that and you could use paint if you want, but I don't know. Nail polish was just a lot easier. And this will not be perfect. I got the green and I splattered it and I actually hit the notebook with the green. So it had like a big blob of green on the front. That's okay because it's not meant to look perfect. And then just continue to do that till you have your desired splatter notebook. Then the third and final notebook is just contacting notebooks. It's really simple, but it's kind of hard. So I just took two holographic contacts, whatever contact you would like, and I started contacting a composition notebook. This was so hard. I'm like a perfectionist, and I have to get it like perfect every time. So I just ended up giving it to my mom and my dad, and they did it like perfect. So just give it to your parents, and they'll probably really do it better than you. And don't use a ruler. I don't know. I just thought it would smooth the bubbles out, but it didn't. Thank you guys for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Love you all so much. Mwah. Bye.